Gronk comes back out of retirement after a year. He was doing the WWE. Uh, mm-hmm. AB was going through some legal issues at the time. He comes in. Leonard Fournette had, just, had gotten released by the Jags. And those are the guys that score all your touchdowns in the Super Bowl. Obviously, when you signed a B, when you signed AB because he's probably the guy that's coming with the most baggage. What was your thought process, and what was he like in the locker room once he got there? Man, I've known AB for a long time. We uh, you guys were in the same draft together, same draft class and everything. So I didn't know him early on in his career. It was probably like two or three years after we had both been in the league. Mm-hmm at Nike. Uh, We had these combines and things at Nike, so definitely knew him. Good dude. Always had a great relationship with him, and so for me, it was easy. It was like, what's up, bro? How you doing, man? Glad you're part of our team. I know you're super talented. This is just the way we like to run things. That's how B.A. expects expectations, and obviously B.A. was very public of what his expectations were of A.B., and he followed through, Uh, so I give him all the credit for for doing that, and I think that's really all he needed is to understand what was expected of him and that's really 90% of the people in the world. Give me my expectations, what you need from me, and then let me go and be an adult. And that's really what he did. And also another guy that was in your draft class with JPP. Did you ever expect, I mean, it doesn't happen, happen normally. Guys that are, you know, you and JPP were first-round draft picks, obviously. But that doesn't normally happen that later down the road, here we are 11 years later, you, AB, and JPP, you're on the same team and you win a Super Bowl together. Yeah, no, it's crazy, man. JPP coming in here, obviously... I tell them all the time, bro. You in the off season, go live in a bubble for me. I love you to death. Just go live in a bubble. <laughs> in August, we're gonna be cool. Everything's gonna be fun. And he's a great talent, uh, fun loving dude. Uh, we enjoy our time together and obviously making plays and a lot of respect for each other. Both coming, like you said, being first round picks. Uh, and really, he's just a special talent. I mean, to be gifted uh, the way he is, and, and I'm excited to be able to have an opportunity to play with him again uh, and hopefully go get another chance to win. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button to become an official member of Club Shay Shay, where we always do something before two something.